to enter the octagon tonight and set to leave with the UFC featherweight championship belt around his waist. As he steps towards this cage, he understands this is one of the biggest moments in his life, the biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion of the world tonight after this fight. Hold Troy, making his way to the octagon, looking to defend his belt. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight championship fight, Troy is 24, Makovsky is 33. Troy is six inches taller. He will have a six inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event. The action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it Seven losses. He stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 125 pounds. Fighting out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, presenting the challenger, Zach Bonsai Makovsky. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 14 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting at a gloomy South Korea, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC featherweight champion of the world, the Korean Super Bowl, Doohong Choi. All right, so for the championship, you've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Do hold short. Ready to fight? Zach Rakowski. Here we go! Tonight's main event of the evening is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for Makovsky. Black trunks for the champion. He's much taller than his opponent tonight. How can he use that to be successful in tonight's fight? Keeping his opponent at the end of his strikes and making sure that his head is out of distance of return strikes. Strong hook to the body by Troy. They have started this fight off with a brawl. Oh, huge suplex. That's a solid punch by Mikovsky. That swelling on his eyes is really starting to get bad. He's got full back mount now. Makovsky's got the full mount again. And he connects. Makovsky with a nice elbow. He's setting up the armbar. 
He's got the arm here. Now he's going to throw his leg over. Turns the hips. He's going to sit back. Almost had the arm bar. And he's going to try to take the back. Side control. Nice knee to the body. Moves to half guard. Wow, look at that. How good is that? Uh -oh. Makovsky's back inside control. Staying busy on the ground. In half guard now. Yeah, he's back in the half guard here. Trying to pass here. I need to scramble, scramble. Here in half guard, you're all good there. And now he's back in full guard. Look at that, that is high level ground game there. Postures up. Side control. There he goes. Back to mount out. again. Makovsky gives up the bat. Half guard. He's working from full mount again. Postures up. Troy's got his back again. Comes over the, the top to the head. No! Round one is in the books. Hey, you can't win every round, okay? It's good. All right, listen. Now we just go back to the drawing board. Do what we practiced. Take it back down. And here's a big suplex. And here we see some really technical offense with submissions. And here we see that again. There's the beautiful Brittany as we get set for round two. You ready to fight? You ready? Second round. The battle continues, and the champion is being pushed to the brink. The top contender looks very good, very calm, very poised, very determined to leave with the belt. Delivered that right to the midsection of his opponent. He's doing a good job of his strike. Inside late kick by Mikowski. Troy with some solid kicks. Look at this. Looking wow. for the clinch. Boom! Oh, he got hurt. He got hurt there, Mike. Hard hook. Huge oh, slam. Nice takedown. Huge Vicious elbow. elbow lands to the head. Half guard. Full guard here. He postures up. The amount of damage that has been done to his body makes you wonder if he's got a broken rib or two. He postures up and punishes the body. Now he's stacking him. Troy with a good right. He's working from half guard now. Opponent pressed up against the cage. Troy gets it back into his guard. He's moved to his back now. He's attacking with the rear naked choke. Now he lost it. Very nice sweep winds up in his opponent's guard. Let's see what he can do from here. Excellent posture. Bukowski with the left. Hard ground and pound elbow. And 
and there's a reversal. Oh, he sweeps. Look at his position now. Holding that front headlock position. He popped out of the guillotine. Vicious ground and pound by the challenger. That's a big punch to the head from the top. Full guard now. See if he looks for a knee. Round number two complete. All right, take a seat, bro. Deep breath. Slow that heart rate down for me. You're good. You're fine here. We knew this was going to be like this. We knew we were going to have a war. You got to cut. Let's take a look at some of the action in that round. Beautiful strike here. Lands on target. And here's a powerful shot that almost ends this fight. And here you see excellent technique and a big slam. Amazing highlights from that round. The lovely Ariani here tonight inside the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. Ready to fight. Ready. The third Go. round of this championship fight is underway. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Troy with a strong leg kick. He's really doing a good job of controlling distance and getting off these shots. That one connected. He avoids the clinch. Inside leg kick. Great exchanges. Oh, oh big slam. Oh, my goodness. Makovsky's passed to now. Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising on his right side. Guard. Half guard. Full guard now. He's taking his back now. Just over Looking three. Now. The rear naked choke. He escapes the rear naked choke. Nicely done, reversal. Connected there. Oh, vicious ground and pound. Makovsky's looking to pass here. He's got his back now. Slides him over, and nice reversal here. Win the scramble! Win the scramble! Makovsky gets it to half guard. Right into guard again, though. Good work from the bottom by Chor. Back to half guard now. He's now working from full guard. Oh, look at that transition! There's a nice left hand. He's got some time to work here, 45 seconds. Oh, this fight's close to being stopped. Oh, he's got oh, his guys back. back. Right to half guard. Now he gets the full mount again. And he got back to guard. Ten seconds. They have oh, done for 15 minutes. And we are headed to the championship round. Man, he's taking some damage. Dual choice eyes are really starting to swell. Both of those eyes are starting to swell shut, Mike. This is starting to get dangerous. And here's another punch that sneaks through. 
And here's another perfectly placed punch. slowing that heart rate down. I know you're not tired. I know you have more in that gas tank. It's time to suck it up and let's get... The beautiful Ariani. You ready to fight? Ready. Ready for the start of round four. This fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Joe, we have made our way to the championship round. This is what separates the men from the... Whoa! Oh. He goes for a head kick and he's down. Hammer fist! Oh, big shot from the top. Oh, he's hurt. That's it. That's it. The fight is over. TKO victory. He was not intelligently defending himself. Too many big shots get through, and that's the end of the fight. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. Let's take one more look at the end of the fight here. This is a vicious series of strikes, ground and pound, that lead up to the TKO. We can see it here on a different angle. There are some big shots getting through here. Vicious ground and pound combination that leads to the TKO. And let's see that from another angle. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 29 seconds of round number four. Going the winner by TKO and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, the Korean Super Boy, Do Ho Choi. Do Ho Choi remains the UFC featherweight champion.